Hey everyone, I'm Lisa and you're watching NoCodeB in 100 seconds. Today, we're diving into the summary bar. It is also known as the aggregation bar, your tool for quick data insights. Let's get started. The summary bar sits at the bottom of your table and provides instant calculations based on your data. Want to know your total sales for the month or average rating of your products? The summary bar has you covered. Here's how to set it up. Navigate to the grid view of the table you wish to configure. Click on the cell of the field you want to summarize and select the desired summary type from the drop-down list. There are some general functions available like empty, filled, percent unique, and there are some specific functions available for different field types like min, max, standard deviation for numeric types, earliest latest date for date types, percent checked or unchecked for checkboxes, and attachment size for attachment types. One of the most powerful uses of the summary bar is when combined with the group by feature. This allows you to get quick, detailed insights at the group level, such as analyzing the total sales or quantities sold for each product category. And here's a great feature. When you share a grid view publicly, the summary is also visible to viewers. They can even modify the summary configuration to suit their needs. However, their changes won't be saved and will revert upon page refresh. With the summary bar, turning raw data into meaningful insights is just a few clicks away. Thanks for watching.